The Samsung Galaxy S21, a new model of the Samsung Galaxy S20. Now there are many different improvements and modifications between the S20 and S21, but first, let's unbox it. Now off the bat, I really like the new style of the camera setup. It's more blended into the phone rather than the S20, and I really like how it's connected on the edge of the phone. It's a lot different from the last year's model. Although, the S21 screen is not as rounded as the S20, and it does not look so futuristic, which is one of the qualities that the S20 has. Now, that's kind of disappointing, disappointing, but both phones have the same camera setup. The rear camera module has a 64 mega telephoto camera, a 12 megapixel wide angle camera, and a 12 megapixel ultra wide camera. And both phones come with an 8 megapixel selfie camera right in the top. The S20 also comes with a Snapdragon 888 processor with it, while the S20 comes with a Snapdragon 865. So theoretically, the S21 should have an increase in speed and performance. With no surprises, both S21 and S20 have the same battery sizes of 4,000 amps. You may ask which one preferably to buy. I would say it's up to you. If you like the new futuristic one of the S20 look, buy that one. But if you want a new up-to-date phone, buy the S21. But both phones have a lot of similarities, but the S21 has a better software embedded within it and a faster processor. Thanks for watching.